I'm Gigi. This is Sable. And you want to know how many chums I have left to get? So, let's see. I had, I have 104. That's how many I have. And I have 61 left to find scattered throughout the world because my chum intuitions were not as good as I wish they were. So that means I'm going to start here at Hercules Beetle Nest. And there are two at the back of the nest, which could be inside the nest. Thought I was pretty thorough in there, but I guess not. Um, and then we've got one that's just like randomly outside the nest for some ungodly reason. So we got two around here, but I'm still missing two more. And they're both at the back of the nest somewhere. See if I can find these guys. I will be referencing a map that I found online a lot. Cause this is too much even for me. Um, can I get in here? Here we go. Random tunnel. I gotcha. Little spot I missed, huh? And I'm getting my controller rumblies already. And there's money in here. Beetle husk dye. Well, guess I can't complain that I found some beetle husk dye. And you. Let's see. Is this on... There's one kind of like right in the center of the shrine or the nest which might be this one yeah that's this one okay so at this leg we'll find a chum and then i'll do some fishing and see what we can fish up over here i guess since we completely missed out on the fishing quest it does give us a good chance to revisit everywhere we've been and pick up the chums we missed and any items we might have missed too apparently Let's see, at the end of this one. See, I just kind of assumed that there was only one with an entrance. And the others were all just like junk. So, I'm getting rumblies. Does that mean it's inside this leg of the thing? Yeah, the rumbles went away when I climbed up. So how do I get inside? this leg of the nest or is it just like down below no there's something in there I can see some geometry poking through okay this is certainly a thing that I'm doing all right I hope you're ready for this to be the next several episodes we still got a couple things to do that aren't chum hunting though. Let me get over this please. It's chum hunting and fishing though. Like we've got to figure out what's going on at the Bridge of the Betrayed. Um, we've got to figure out how to get into Pyrausta. And we have to talk to Fear at the Mysterious Shrine and see how that quest is going to conclude. Can I not like drop into this from above? Here we go. Nope, this is just a hole. Okay. If that was the entrance, I think I would have been a little bit upset. That means there must be a way from inside to get to that chum. Whew. I really did not expect there to be 60 more chums. And that I just really missed that many. That's little bit upsetting but you know it is what it is come on nope stop it sable you need to regain your stamina and then you can climb you gotta make it inside here i assume and look for another tunnel This is the only way in, as far as I'm concerned. 
That beetle mother definitely has nothing to do with getting in. All right, let's see. Which side are we looking at? We're looking at this side. So there's just some like small little tunnel that I missed, huh? Let's take a look, see. It will be lowered down. I'll pick up some of these while I'm here. They'll sell. Um, okay, we're falling. Oh, here we go. This just blends right in. That's what I missed. Okay. I have a feeling this is going to be a lot of me being, oh, it's right here because I just have missed that many things. Weird pulsing eggs. You are in the floor, Sir Chum. Well, I'm glad at least we could get the Chum mask without needing to use a guide. And now, whoa, lagging a whole lot. There's one just randomly right here outside the beetle nest. And I'm not, nope, clear all markers, please. Let's warp back outside, and I'll do some fishing before I go over there. Like right here. Let's point ourselves, and D-pad right. Um, nope. Let's aim a little bit left. A little bit less. Can I not fish here? I cannot fish here. Lame. Um, I need to press this button. Do any of the other D-pad buttons do anything? I can sit? Okay, well I just figured out what I need to do about Pyrousta. And left and up don't do anything. I need to sit in the fucking sulfuric pool at Pyrousta. I have a sit button? Are you kidding me? This is news to me. Alright, well, come on, Samoon. Let's fish at this one. Can I get anything? Samoon is slowly floating away. Hey, hey, get over here. Whoa, you're fast. Come on, you can't escape me. I got you. I swear, I'm gonna have missed like a million chums at the whale, and it's gonna be a nightmare to find all of them. Yeah, what I got? Bello Guppy, I was looking for you. It pulses its way through the sands using an air propulsion system that grows at the end of its tail. When frightened, the force of the propulsion can cause the bellow to drop off, leaving the fish stranded. Neat. I will say, finding all the fish, that's intrinsic motivation right there. I do want to find all the fish. Oh, I can see it from here. That is such a lame chum. Why is it just out in the middle of nowhere? And I always explore the middle of nowhere, but I didn't explore the middle of nowhere around here. That was, there went that sound again of like some something crashing and like exploding, but Mm. I also think there is, I was, I briefly looked over the map already, um, but I think there is a chum that's just like on top of every little racing hut and I just never climbed on top of them after I did them. I completely forgot to do that or even think about that. All right, who's up here? You're just in the middle of nowhere. I mean, like, you can, I guess if you looked out from the Hercules beetle place, you could see it, but I don't know. I'm not too happy about that one. All right. Um, let's call some moon over here. Come on, some moon. Where you go? Let's go. We got fish to catch. Where can I find a rando plant? Let's see if this one will get us anything. Release. Blink. 
Anything? Anything? Yes. Okay. You seem easier. Are you gonna be one I've already caught? You're n no. You're a dopey dart. I have caught you. That's all right. They're definitely gonna. I wonder if it's like specific plants, or oh, yep, that was a cool move, Simone. I see you flexing. Or if it, I don't really know where I'm going right now. Um, I'm gonna check out one of these plants. Let's see if I can get anything from you. You're not very close, but that's fine. Hello, Simone. Anything? Yes. Are you just another dopey dart? Yes. Okay. You're probably not going to find much else around here. Now, let's see where I'm headed. I want to go up here, because there are two there that I missed. Um, let's see. Oh, but back here. So, like, um,. I'll warp to the wind tower. There are a few chums at the wind tower that I missed as well. Um, let's see. I think I found two chums here and there are five chums here. Let's take a look. Um, no, I found three chums. So let's see, there's going to be a chum next to this one and a chum kind of at like the back of the wind tower. Let's do some fishing though. Can I fish around here? No, so it seems like I can only fish on like these natural sands, like when there's like, um, when I'm kind of, yeah. So when there's like a raised sand that kind of denotes that you're at a special location, um, you can't fish. Let's see if I can get any from this plant. Anyone? It's looking unlikely. Oh, there we go. Okay, but you're kind of moving like a dopey dart. So you just a dopey dart. Yeah. So that seems to be like the usual one around these parts. All right, let's get climbing again. Oh boy. I wonder if I could like fish from way up high on the wind tower. At the very least, I don't have to like spend too much time like searching around these areas. I can just go straight for my objectives because my objectives are chums. But it might be a wise idea to edit this down, but it kind of might be fun to just run around the world again. We're not going to be here too much longer after all. There's not too much stuff left to do in the game. I think anyway. Who knows, maybe a whole new part of the map. <laughs> not There's not going to be another part of the map, but maybe like a new whole quest line will open up once we go back to the Ewer. Come on. Get me across this bridge. Um, yeah, I have the stamina for this. I do have the stamina for this, actually. Let's regain a little bit, though. Oop. So, let's see. We've got a chum next to this one to my right. So, up there somewhere, it's going to be a chum. And I'll go into that, like, deserty part and... There'll probably be a chum in there, or in that deserty part, yeah. The kind of straight between the uh, Ewer and the Sodic Waste, or that leads to the Sodic Waste. Because um, I think there'll be some new fish there. That's kind of like a different environment. I'm just gonna like see a chum from a distance that I just like completely, totally missed. So that feels possible. Climb a little higher up. I also missed like six chums in the Ewer, which I'm not happy about. Okay, let's see. 
Um, no. So somewhere around here is a chum. It could be indoors. It could be down there. I was down there before already. I'm not seeing it just like sitting out here. It's not one like on top, thank God. Maybe just like around here. Hmm. Tricky, tricky chums. Might be like inside the structure a little bit more. So here's this one. The next one is going to be more around here. These rocks are floating. Oh my god. The floating rock almost made me just jump right off. Don't tell me it's down there. Let's zoom in on my map. Um, no. Definitely not. It's definitely like within the bounds of the wind tower. Let's just start climbing and see if we can't get any controller rumbles. Where even am I? Hmm. Oh, there's a locked chest in there. I completely missed this room. That's why this chum hunt is a little bit good for me. Because I can find things I didn't find before. Okay, let's regain our stamina. And we can come from outside. What are you? Why are you sitting here? Oh, there's our bouldering top. Nice. I didn't read the description, but too late. Not interested. Hmm. Now, where on the map are we? We're going away from our chum location. Come on, game. You know you want to give me your chums. See, like, in there is probably where it is, right? No, because it's kind of like... Hmm. This is tricky, 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 tricky. Because it should be like right around here, maybe a little bit more over here. Let's just explore this building a little bit more. Oh, am I getting... No, that was from the perpetual. Hmm. Mm hmm hmm. Chum hunting is a little less fun when I have to actively search around nooks and crannies and hidden places. It's definitely more fun when you just like you're out exploring and you see them. That is something I can say for certain. Okay, let's climb up this wall. Might have to go through that door down there. I'm not sure where that door leads. It might just lead outside. Come on, Sable. Not up here, that's for sure. So let's see if this just leads outside. Yeah. Okay. Let's see. Definitely like a little more north than this. It's down here. It's somewhere. This just leads back here. And we get to listen to some nice music. That's a bonus, right? Let's look for the chum that's more at the back of the wind tower. Let me check my map real quick. Hmm. The, the map is a little bit blurry that I'm using, and the chum symbols take up a lot of the space. So it's kind of hard to see where exactly they might be, but the chum I'm looking for might be a little bit to the right of this one, but I don't think that makes any sense. 
because that's just like right outside. This one is like right on the edge of a cliff. So I think the one we're looking for is more right here-ish. And then we've got one at like the back, which is more to my, more up and to the right is where I'll find it. So maybe at like top of this cliff. I don't see no chums. I'm not vibrating at all. I can't even climb up this one. Oh, there he is. You there. You were less of a pain to find than the other ones around here. But there is still another one around here. Yeah. Uh, chum hunting. Mm. See, when I started the game, I was like, please don't let it be 900 Korok seeds. And it's not 900 Korok seeds, but when the, that, mm, it's still kind of, mm, you know, 165 is a lot better than 900, that's for sure. Okay, where exactly on my map do I need to be? A little bit like behind where I'm pointing. So like over here? No, it's just like a crack in the wall. Where in the world is this chum? Hey, hey, Sable, let's calm down. Oh my, uh, momentum. Okay, well, we're down here again. So let's just do a quick search around here. So there is one chum right here. And this is like right on the outside. So unless there's another one that's like down below, which is totally possible. I'll be a little bit upset if it is. It's just like, it seems more like the one I'm looking for is slightly to the left, but I don't want, I'm just gonna jump down. Yeah, there it is. Oh, you, you're a nasty one. That's what you are. You're a nasty one to look for. But I found you. That's all the chums in this area. And there aren't any more chums in this, like, straight towards the sodic wastes. But there are fish. Um, I don't know if my timer's still very going. Yes, we have two minutes on the timer. Plenty to catch some fish. I can find some in. Maybe we can fish at this tree and we might find something. Moon. You teleported. Let's go. Let's go fish at this tree so we will find if we find anything. I love that you just like fish through the sand. I don't know if I'll catch anything. Or I might just catch like a dopey whatever. Yeah, this is looking kind of dopey. Yeah, so I want to be a little bit closer. I want to fish like right in its roots. No, we can do better than that. Nope, we can do better than that. Okay, this is pretty, cl I think this would be close enough if there is anything in the roots of this tree. But you are looking like a dopey dart. Yeah, that's unfortunate, but we got a new place to look around at. We got to fish in the roots of some cacti. That's what we got to do. And get sick air time. Yahoo. Just 
go throw ourselves right in the middle of this area. And that's the timer. Noted. Noted. Um, let's just throw. See what happens. <laughs> right around that cactus. Can't see it. Oh, but I can't see that. You're not a dopey dart, are you? Oh, come on. I know we got some unique fish around here. Maybe I should really look into buying what's her name's clues. I wonder if casting length will have anything to do with it. Come on. Come on. Here, fishy, fishy. Here, fishy, fishy. I need to have patience. Oh, come on. I don't need more dopey darts. Maybe I'm gonna make like a fortune off dopey darts, right? Right between these two. Um, I wanna do better than that. There we go. Anything at all? We're waiting. Oh, I nearly missed it. That's another dopey dart. I'm getting just a little bit frustrated. But I need to have patience, or so I've been told. What about at you? Nope, that's on the plant. I think that's on the plant again. That was like the same exact spot. There we go. Anything here that isn't a dopey dart? Ooh, you went this way. Ooh, you're new. Yeah, what are you? Come on. Come on. You can't you can't escape my grasp. Oh, you're the bellow guppy again. Shoot! I've already caught that one! Oh no. Um. Hmm. What about you? I gotta throw a little further than that. If this just gets me something I've already got, then I'll concede and buy hints from. What's her face? Yeah, this is a dopey dart. All right, game, you've bested me. I don't want this to be just like a nothing episode though. So let's go do the maps in this episode as well. And to make sure that things stay a little bit interesting, we're not just going fishing all the time. Um, I'll start next episode at the Mysterious Shrine and see if Fear has translated those writings yet. Hopefully she has. Alright, Chari. Was your name Chari? That's the name I remember you were named. Cassie, not Chari. Hello again, Sable. Yoshi says hello. Uh, she lights up and I really like to see it. Yoshi, oh no, she's laughing. Oh no, are you are you an apprentice of his or no, you, oh no. Did he tell you how terrible I was when he was trying to teach me? Well, I've learned, I've learned well the power of a sentence unfinished. I let my well hang in the air and Cassie understands. Well, I'm glad he hasn't changed. Honestly, I'm pleased enough he says hello because I sort of, it's not even that I thought he'd be disappointed even, just thought he might forget. I shake my head and tell Cassie what Yoshi told me, and the compliments make her get smaller and smaller behind her hands, but I can tell they fill her up with particular joy. She shakes her head and flaps her hands when I tell her the worst of it. Yoshi is proud of her. I hate to hear that, she laughs. Or, no, I don't. I really, it's nice. It actually really is nice. I'm just, you know, it's, it's really nice. Oof. Do you ever feel like it's hard to hear nice things about yourself? Yes. Cassie nods and sighs, calmer than before. I'm glad you get it. 
And thanks, Sable. You really made my day. No problem, Cassie. Um, do you know where I can catch some fish? Here's what I've got. So I don't need this. I kind of want to just like buy them all anyway, just because the completionist in me wants everything. And this is only five. So I'm just gonna buy as many as I can and we'll see what this gets me. Easy, I had enough money for all of them. Um, goodbye. Take care, Sable. All right, so let's look at some of these notes real quick just before we end out. Um, are they gonna be in fishing? No. Quest? They're in quest. Oh boy. Oh boy, we've got a lot of these. Um, what are the ones we're looking for? Pebble Eye and Pillfish. Um, Pebble Eye. In the heart of Midden, below Pillars of... Um, extremely common in the Sansies. No shit. Oh, they're just... So that's just like... Common in the Sands of Midden. Hard to miss. Pebble Eye. Common fish that seeks shade in the eastern dunes. Okay. Little kicker like koi, hummer, pillfish. Persistence will pay off when fishing in areas full of cacti. Oh man, so if I had just like fished a couple more times, I could have found one. Okay. Well, next time we will actually be able to find some fish now that we have some clues about where to look. And we'll also continue our chum hunting efforts. I will see you then.